Rich. Hey. Rich. So my name on all the belts. What's your name? Marquise Hancho Williams. How long you been boxing? Going on two years now. So in this game that you've been in for two years, what would you say? Or what, what would you say got you into boxing? Well, I'm, I'm from A-League, Texas, you know, so fighting, squabbling, coming up as a kid, that, that, that's like religion. So, you know, i always been a fighter. Sports, that's always been my thing. But uh, during 20, uh, 20, 2017, while I was watching the Floyd and McGregor fight during Hurricane Hall, I was shot. Uh, fractured my uh, right femur, biggest bone in your body. Had to learn how to walk all over again. And shit, I was sitting, I had an epiphany, I was sitting in the hospital. I told myself, you know, it's something I always wanted to do. And if I could ever get back on my feet, ever get back to halfway, possible halfway functional, I was gonna go all out. And so shit, was I got back walking, got off the crutches, got off the cane, walked in the boxing ring and then it took off. So you got a story of pure determination. That's what it sounded like. Something like that was just an ambition that, uh, that can't be submitted. I like that, I like that. Yeah, that's crazy because I was going to ask you the next question. Where you from? And you said it. They need, they need Texas. Well, explain it over state in Texas. Like, what is that? Is that Dallas? Is that Houston? You know what I mean? Uh, Houston, Texas got it. was like tatted on. Third coast to the, to the fully. But uh, Aileyville, it's a special section in the southwest side of Houston. You know, made up of all types of different different uh, demographics. It's just, it, 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 it's, it's a real special place. They got air, uh, We got three high schools. Uh, and we didn't put boys in the league, NFL and basketball. We got rappers that come out of Ailey, Texas. Charlotte Twins, they come out of Ailey, Texas. It's just it's a special formula. You know, as we go down this journey, you, you'll see a little bit more, but that remains to be said. So, with that being said, who was your mentors in this boxing game? Uh, well, my inspiration in the boxing game will always be our league. So what's the deal, little man? Where you from? Here in Houston, Texas. What part? South. Okay. Uh, how long you been boxing? About two years. About two years. How many fights you got? Three. Yeah. What made you get into boxing? Well, I seen lots, lots of pro fighters whenever I was a little kid. So I just said I was going to try it out. Okay. So who would you say your favorite fighter would be? Um, mainly right now is Canelo. Canelo? Okay. Uh, you got any other favorite fighters besides Canelo? No, not really. Oh, I like that. So you a diehard Canelo fan. Okay, cool. How many fights you got? Three. Okay, cool. So, yeah, so how, how old are you, little man? Oh, yeah, so you just starting. Just coming about. So as you can say, since you started to now, where do you think your skill set is at? Mm. Okay, cool. So, who, who's your coach? Oh, where he from? Okay, okay. So, I see you got that dog working. You know what I'm saying? Get the right work in as you should. Uh, so, uh, we're gonna say you three fights in. You got any fights coming up? Uh, yeah. Any tournaments coming up? All right, so yeah, uh, you know, uh, we gonna say the people definitely gonna be looking forward to seeing you. you know what I'm saying so you three fights in, you know. Hopefully next time we see you got a lot more fights in them, you know, and all that. Uh, who gave you inspiration to box? Okay, so Canelo gave you the motivation to box. So you see yourself as a, a, a champion one day, or as you should. You know what I'm saying get ready for Golden Gloves. Okay. Okay, cool. We looking forward to seeing you again, man. That's what I'm talking about. You gon' stand it all, stand tall. If you gon' stand it all, stand firm on your word. They respect you through it all. So what's the deal, my man? What's good? What's your name? I'm a George, but uh, my name is Kyle G. Okay, okay, okay. Where you from? I'm really from Victoria. Take okay. a little smaller. It's like I can see the power of the mini city, about the size of the South Bridge. Okay. You look. Okay. But I've been around all the time. You know what I'm saying? I just decided to make my head cool. Thanks. Okay. Cool.
So, you know, uh, you know, as I'm looking around this gym or whatever, I see they got everything going on. They got the little jiu-jitsu in the background. They got the kickboxing going on and the boxing. Is this this your home gym? Nah. Uh, home okay. gym. That's fight up. Same grid. Okay. 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 You come here, I'm, a, I'm the only one in uh, you know, the grid team that we've been making. Okay. I'm trying to do that whole thing. So, so my man is going to start off teaching me to stand up, get my hands right. Okay. So, 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 uh, where's your coach from? Philly. Okay. Cool. So, big, so yeah, I've been hearing Shout his name. Out, <laughs> I've been hearing his name a whole lot. So, who, who do you train with in uh jujitsu and and the kick, kickboxing? And you know, cause that's all the MMA and all that. Uh, yeah. So back here. Is any of these guys over here? Who you need your coach over here? Who <laughs> oh, right here with the blue shirt? Yeah, okay. My kickboxing coach right here. Okay. 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 So that's your kickboxing coach. Okay. Cool. 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 And then you got another coach for jujitsu. Yeah. Okay. So how long you been uh in the MMA world? Shit. I, before I went to prison, I, I got a one amateur body in before. Okay. I had to go do my bids. So I got like one amateur about him before I did my, did my bid. So whenever I did my bid, I kind of, when I came home, things wasn't what it was supposed to be. So I can just dive back into it. Okay. And you know, time presented itself. And I got a war as hard, so he kept pushing on So basically you can say it was it was in you to do this. Okay, cool, cool. So who, who would you say would be your favorite MMA fighter? Of all time, just period. Yeah, all time, it don't matter. Like you can give me your top three. Give me your top three. Man, it's just Phil. Okay. Right now, Israel. I'll give it to him. Okay. Man. Okay. Give him that. And another motherfucker that has like Mad Hart was Kimball. Okay. Cool. One of the best MMA fighters we had. Mad Hart. Rest in peace, RP. Okay. Okay. Oh, that, that's a nice. That's a nice little lineup. I see you. I see you nice on my So, where you see yourself in this MMA MMA game in the next five years? Next year, I'm going to be fighting. Be fighting. Oh, damn. He said next year. <laughs> so, the, so, the next five, you can say belt holder. You know what I'm saying? They said I was Oh, I like that. You know, people, people always say that, but you know, it's all about the dog. Yeah, I mean, I, mean I, I, I like that. I like that. I like that. I mean, so I'm looking forward to seeing you, you know, with some, with some MMA belts, some MMA medals. Remember that. Remember that. Yeah. yeah. Paradigm. Hopefully they back me up, you know, sponsors and shit. Well, I mean, we get that shit popped up there. Okay. So if say Paradigm don't back you up, who else you got in sight that you think will back you up? They're going to come find me. I like that. I like they don't that. Come find me. Once they see what's going on, they don't come find me. I just gotta put myself in position. So when the time for the transition comes, I'm just gonna jump right into that thing, just like this. You jump right into this thing. I quit my job. I ain't wanna work. I wanna fight. I like that. See, that's what you call real ambition, real heart, real determination. I mean, yeah, a lot of a lot of these cats don't really have it, man. They need more of that, and it'll be a lot more of positive things going on, man. I respect that, man. I really do. Like, that's definitely that takes a lot. I mean, for you to just step out of your comfort zone, you know, working guaranteed money, you know, this and that to, to take what you what you believe in. I mean, so yeah, you know, they not living, they just slaving, not doing what they love. And I'm doing what I love. I decided to quit slaving. I like that. I'm doing what I love. I mean, I train Monday through Friday. This is my job. I don't care about nothing else, really, but the kids, my family. Other than that, it's dead. So even if I don't go professional, I'm going to punch on somebody. <laughs> Where you from, little man? Houston, Texas. What part? A. Okay, how long you been boxing? Uh, for like three months now. Okay, so what made you want to get into boxing? Uh, no, I just, well, I've been watching some highlights of, I've been watching some highlights of Muhammad Ali and Mike Tyson. Okay, so you can say that's like your inspiration to box? Yeah. So who would be your favorite fighter? Okay, okay. I see, I see you. All right, all right. So you got any fights, little man? No. All right, well, I see you got the, you know, you got the head gear behind you, you got the gloves, you got the, the cup on and all that. So uh, that means you've been getting some work? Yeah, I was working for like three, three fights, four fights, okay. you know, stuff like that. Oh, okay, so you formed to be a little dog, that's what you're gonna say, you know what I mean? So, uh, I, 
Where you see yourself at in the next five years in boxing? An ambassador championship. Ooh, I like that. Ooh, so who, who your coach? Coach. Where he from? Philly. Okay. Okay, okay, I see it. He's been popping up a lot lately, man. So, you know, I, I'm I, I, I'm looking forward to seeing you in the boxing world. You know, you just starting off fresh, and it seemed like you with the right team and all that. So, little man, keep doing your thing, man. <laughs> Living in Philadelphia, instead of catching a ball, you might be catching a show. Easy. 